Hey everyone, my name is Benj Heish, and we're definitely not going to go over a bunch of gear today like we sort of normally would, but I A, wanted to announce the winners for the giveaway that I put up about three weeks ago now. Um, finally getting around to, you know, finding all the people for those giveaways. But then also, just with the holidays coming up this next week or so, wanted to give a, I guess, quick little encouragement of sorts to anyone out there that's watching this that loves photography. Oftentimes, at least for me, when we go to these events, we see people that we don't necessarily get to see all the time. And the longer that I've lived life, and although I'm not that old yet, I find that a lot of those images tend to be some of the most important images for me that I take all year, regardless of outside of my professional work or inside my personal work, whatever. The simple, you know, snapshots of my own grandmother interacting with my kids and my parents and our cousins and their cousins and, you know, just all the people that come together along the holidays. I would just encourage you with whatever camera you have, even if it's your iPhone or something, be that person. If you appreciate photography, bring a camera to your events this coming week. If you have them, whether it is, you know, an iPhone or a point and shoot camera or one of these cameras or, you know, bring it, bring your 5D series. Who cares? Just I find that those are some of the most important images and important things in our lives that we can make photos of and we can use our gifts, talents, abilities, passions towards. And as someone who carries a camera with me at just about all times possible, I know it is awkward at times to be the one that shows up with the camera. It's just really, really important to, as my good friend Matt Day says, to document your life, make sure you take photos of those around you, and even bring cameras like an iPhone or an X100 or something that is easy to pass off to someone else. And don't be afraid to take photos of the people that you love and ask them to take photos of you as well, because I know a lot of us, myself included, end up having all of their visual history looking like this. So anyway, just wanted to encourage everybody out there to, if they're on the fence about bringing a camera to an event or a celebration or a holiday party or a Christmas party or whatever the case may be, just bring a camera, do what you can to document your own life and the lives of those around you. And now that we've done that and I've done preaching to you all, I, I'm gonna announce the winners of the giveaway. Now we have a bunch of different things. I wanna say again, thank you to Clever Supply Co and Moment. I definitely wanted to say thank you to those two companies in particular for helping me just give some nice things to you. So here we go for the Clever Strap. Mark, John, uh, you actually commented, I love Clever Supply Straps and you were the first person on the list. So clever supply straps for you, my friend, kind of worked out pretty nice for that. Don, you oddly enough were the second person that came up on my list, and this is the random order that I put the items in, and you won the Fujifilm moment bag that came up as. So honestly, uh, it kind of worked out perfectly. And Daryl, actually, we were messaging back and forth on Instagram randomly as I was choosing the winners, and you said that you had bought the presets over Black Friday. So because of that, I've obviously switched you out to winning the Moment Cinebloom filter. So that's awesome. And also thank you for purchasing my presets. That makes me feel great. And the winner of the presets themselves though is going to be in front of strangers. So I hope you enjoy those. The Cascade LUTs are going to go to Julian. Sorry you missed out on the strap, my friend, but uh, hopefully you do video enough to enjoy the LUTs. And then on a similar note, Joel, you are the winner of the uh, moment collaboration lesson about photographing couples that I did with them. So uh, you seem like you are into film and hopefully you like to photograph couples. And if not, you know, let us know and we can uh, pass that on to somebody else. And then Jonathan Stockdale, uh, you were just the bonus winner of winning a mug because Austin Park was actually the winner of the mug, but you said Loki would love to get one of those mugs and you know, might as well. So anybody that has won any of these things, obviously get in contact with me, you know, via 
email, direct message, Twitter, Instagram, whatever. Uh, and I'll get your contact information. And then for the people who, you know, I need a physical address for, I will make sure to get those mailed out to you. And then I just want to say a big thank you to everyone for watching the channel this year and everyone that's commented and subscribed and liked and all that kind of stuff. Honestly, it's been a fun thing for me and I really do hope that I can do more videos like this. And honestly, the only way that I can do more videos like this is if I get support from people like you that are watching this very random video. So just wanna say thank you to everyone who has supported me in this new endeavor. And then just wanted to also, again, encourage you all to bring a camera out to whatever kind of events you may or may not have in the next couple of weeks and just generally, you know, document your life. There's a lot of very, very important things out there that I wish I had documented, you know, before people have passed away or, you know, as I watch my kids grow up, I see them changing all the time and I would give anything to have more videos and photos and stuff of them at younger ages. So I'm always trying to get out there and be fine with being that annoying person that has a camera at every event and just know that it's something that I really honestly value and enjoy. So just wanted to put that out to anyone watching because I'm assuming as someone who's watching a very photography focused YouTube channel, you may feel the same as well. So thanks again, everyone. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all on the next one.